What are you two doing today? Hey guys, as you can see, I'm sporting Honey and Ruby t-shirt and I made a big boo-boo because I was planning like a month ago to order some more triple X and double X uh, t-shirts, which I, which I totally forgot about it and now it's too late before Christmas and you know, the whole separation with Adrian going through all the emotions and it totally escaped my mind so I did not order any, but, uh, but I still have plenty of extra large, large, medium, smalls, with the v-neck classic ones and i'm running a special this whole month of december 25 percent off on them so link will be down below in the description go get yourself a t-shirt for christmas honey and ruby would appreciate it i would appreciate it and uh, let's get into this video guys right <laughs> what are you doing running back and forth in front of me here <laughs> a little bit used up two different laces a little bit ripped up here i don't think i'm gonna be interested in the shoes oh, so What else you got there? I got uh, DVDs. We stopped buying DVDs. Oh, we don't buy, yeah, only Blu-rays right now, no DVDs. Uh, what about the... Uh, it's an other case for what phone, do you know? Uh, Samsung, Samsung, uh, the Z3, uh, all the different ones. Yeah, Galaxy 3, Galaxy 2. Yeah, a little bit too old. Oh, okay. Just, you know, a lot of these phones are not on the market anymore, you know? So. Yeah. What's in a baggie? Yeah, I'm just looking to get. One of the things. Oh, no, I didn't. I thought it broke off. Looks a little bit like a Murano glass, but it's a glued piece, so I don't think it is. Yeah, sorry, unfortunately, I wouldn't That's be interested in that. Sorry, I couldn't help you. That's okay. Okay. Quick tip video. If you are using a thermal printer like Rolo, uh, Zebra, or uh, Dymo, and if you're not, you should, because it will save you a lot of money in the long run, period. But here's the quick tip. If you're losing the 4x6 labels for any of these printers, and currently I'm using Rolo, but I did use Dymo before, so I know for the fact that it works on a Dymo as well. I'm not 100% on Zebra, but I think it will work as well. This is how I get my labels. I get them either in a roll, there's two thousands on a roll, or in a box when there's 6,000 count and these are UPS labels. If you are on eBay and you're shipping on eBay and you are shipping on Amazon, I'm sure you are shipping through UPS a lot. All you have to do is set up account directly with UPS and long as you are shipping with them, uh, and I do quite a bit, you can get these labels for free from them. No question asked. You have two options. They sell them in a roll like this. There's 2,000. And like I said, in a box with a 6,000 count. Currently, I'm using them out of the box. I'm almost empty. You can see the box is almost empty there. And they come in sheets like that. And I just have a little basket. Or... They come on a roll and I use this basket with this little wood piece that I just drop in here and it just rolls, which I like actually much better. So I order one of each. A setup like this for 6,000 will last me one year. So there you go, guys. Free labels. If you want to save some money, stop paying, you know, 32 bucks for a thousand. I think that's what Uline charges. A roll of a thousand is like 32 bucks. You can save quite a bit of money. If you like this tip, 
Make sure you hit that thumbs up, huh? Give me that thumbs up. Ryan strike a very nice deal with this lady. Yesterday, he posted all these leftovers, uh, leftover toys that we got from step two that uh, we bought when Toys R Us closed down over two years ago now. And we still have quite a few of them here. And uh, lady came in yesterday, bought a few of them, filled up her truck. Yep. And today morning she came back and decided, you know what, I'm gonna buy it all. I guess she uh, she helps raise money for some cancer foundation. Is that correct, Ryan? That's what she told me. Yeah. Yeah, for her her sister has uh, has a cancer, and she's her husband puts everything together as far as these toys goes because they're all loose in the boxes. He puts them all together, and then she sells them, and all the money that proceeds from this uh, are going to cancer foundation. So we we gave her a really good deal. I mean. Yeah. I mean, basically half the cost. Of half of, of the original prices that we were asking, you know, like we had a kitchen like that for 40 bucks. Originally retails for 60, we had it for 40. We gave it to her for 20 bucks. Um, so I'm very happy it's going to a good cause and we are getting a lot of uh, shelf space back that we can reorganize here. So now we're gonna load up the whole, uh, and she's only a few minutes away. We're gonna load up the trailer. I don't know if we're gonna fit everything. We're gonna try, but I doubt it. Might be two trips, but very happy. Very happy this happened. Good job, Ryan. Good job posting this yesterday. Perfect timing, you know? Yeah. Looking good. First, first trailer to load up. We kept it with one piece that it's been put together. And we still have 16 boxes to go. So this is gonna be a second trip involved in this, but... Well, guess who showed up here? Remember this bag from a previous video? All right, I mean, let me record this because some of you, somebody asked me about this. And I don't know if it was on a message on Facebook or was it on Instagram or email or just in uh, comments. I can't find this message. I, bought, I talked to this lady on a previous video. She came in here, she wanted to sell me a lens and a camera with original stock lens this is the the 7d in very good overall condition the only thing that she took out it was her memory card because she had some pictures on it comes with the charger six batteries uh original lens on it i think it's 18 to 50 no 28 to 80 and then there's a separate lens here this one is 75 to 300 and this one looks like it's in mint condition so one of you guys and there's a lot of other accessories but one of you guys messaged me and i don't know i can't find that message that pete if she ever comes back and if you're willing to sell this for 400 dollars, i will buy it so um message me again if you're interested or somebody else is interested like i said i, I that's what I would probably try to get out of this unit. Maybe a little bit more, but $400, I think it's a very good price for somebody to pick up this camera. So, uh, and she came in and she says, I'm back and I'll take the $400. So I'm like, ma'am, I said, maybe I can get $400 out of it. I never said I'll give you four. I said, I can give you 250. And she says, no, no, you said four. I said, no, I said 250. So she said, okay, I'll take 250, but I'm like, good try. Uh, so yeah, any of you guys that are interested, let me know, I'll set it aside. We're not gonna put this on the floor. I'm not gonna have this, uh, Vicky list this. I'll wait for the message if somebody's interested. Very nice 7D body with uh, two lenses, six batteries and some other accessories. These are some filters. There's some other stuff here so all kinds of goodies and a nice and nice carrying bag so let me know what you doing in there crazy you waiting for your friend are you waiting for your friend let's go get your friend come on girl got your fresh water come on come on come on step up good girl yeah your friend your friend is waiting Yeah, your friend is waiting. Uh -huh. 
Yeah? I was like, what's going on? Come on out. So she's been uh, climbing into the cage mainly because she sits right there in that corner and waits for the mouse to come out. No, no, you stay in. Hey, Rube. Come on. Come on. Out, 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 out. She waits for... There's little mice that go behind the safe and they come out here and especially now at the end of the season when they run into the building from the outside. She's been hunting them like crazy. Yeah, see? She's uh she knows they're in there behind the safe. 